Barbaris Lenciolata Kamali in Tib and in Urdu it is called as a Kala Simlu the fruits are edibles the aerial parts that is the leaves and stems are used for the throat infection they are also used uh, to treat the backache rheumatism and a joint pain while the roots of this plant berberis contain the yellowish dyes and the berberis roots are commonly used by the traditional communities in the mountain region for the backache for the bone fractures and they are also commonly used for the joint pain as well Berberis is one of the important medicinal species. It is utilized by different cultures in Europe, Asia and Africa because of its active ingredient berberine. Berberine is one of the important active ingredient of this species. Berberine has a strong antiviral antibacterial efficacy. It is commonly used for the heart attack and it is also recommended to normalize the blood pressure. It is also one of the important drugs that is used for fatty liver. So it reduces the cholesterol and extra lipids in liver. Berberis is also one of the important traditional medicinal plants that is used due to the active ingredient berberine for rheumatism, joint pain and number of the disorders. From taxonomic point of view, Berberis lanceolatum belong to family Berberidaceae. The leaves contain spines, the stems also contain spines and the roots are deeper in the soil with yellowish color. However, the fruit of this plant is called as Berberi. So the botanical name is called as Berberis lanceolatum and commonly it is called as Berberi fruit. Berberis lanceolatum which belong to family Berberidaceae is commonly distributed in the mountainous region, especially the steep slopes, the slopey areas and commonly it has a strong association with the treatophyte. Here you see this is a strong relationship between the Berberis and the fern, the treatophyte. So this is a joint symbiotic association. They both provide some moisture and nutrients to each other. <music>